Hi everyone. Um, it's World Mental Health Awareness Day and I hadn't made a post, oh, it sounded really Canadian, but I made a post um, about it, but I just wanted to jump on here and talk about it. Uh, mental health is something I'm very passionate about and I think it's something we as a community and culture and generation and pe just people, just humans, really need to talk about more and um, connect with about and, you know, end the stigma that surrounds it that, you know, it's bad or you, it's taboo or you don't talk about it. Look, I just had my therapy session with my therapist uh, via FaceTime this last hour, cried randomly <laughs> over things and, um, you know, found a lot of insight about... Uh, my life, my past, what I've been through, things that hurt me, things that changed me. And, you know, I really encourage anybody and everyone to go into therapy, even if you think like, I don't have any problems, I don't need this. Cause look, I was the same boat. I was like, I don't need therapy. I'm strong, I don't have any issues. But you know, the moment you can set aside your ego because that's what was really blocking me from being the best person that I could be and really taking a really difficult, truthful, honest look at myself and look at the way I was treating myself and living and um, the certain blocks or, you know, walls I had in my life. It wasn't until I started therapy that, uh, those really started to come down and I really started to have a lot of new awarenesses and grow as a person. And, um, you know, look, it just, it's helped me so much. It's helped a lot of people I know. And I hope if you're struggling out there, you know, you're not alone. You're worthy. You're beautiful. You're special. Um, it does get better. And don't be afraid to talk about it. Don't be afraid to reach out. Don't be afraid to call a hotline. Don't be afraid. Instagram cut me off. <laughs> um, but yes, my ending sentiment as I just kind of speak candidly and from the heart about this is that mental health is like any health. It's like brushing your teeth. It's like taking a bath. It's like going to the gym. If you don't work on it, how do you expect it to be healthy? You know, if you don't feed your body healthy foods, how do you expect your body to be healthy? And I think our minds um, are very much a part of that because, you know, depending on our, everyone's experience and childhood and upbringing, you know, sometimes it's, it's just, look, things happen and our minds get developed in certain ways in different ways that sometimes it's not healthy or we have an experience or we have something that scares us or stresses us out or hurts us deeply or traumatizes us. And, you know, unfortunately that is life and that will affect our mentality too. So again, um, look, I'm an advocate for therapy. I'm an advocate for um, mentally being healthy and speaking to yourself and loving yourself the very best you can and just knowing you're important and just as you are, you're worthy. So I hope anyone out there, if this helps and I didn't drone on for too long.